Hey guys, thanks so much for tuning in to yet another edition of Study Crypto. Today, we're going to go over what I would do if I only had $100 to invest right now. It would be in elephant money. Elephant money. This is a brand new platform. Well, not that brand new. This has been around for a few months. And it's quite honestly one of the most impressive platforms I think I've seen in all of DeFi, um, quite honestly, uh, in, in terms of helping people build their wealth. But first, before we get into it, do us a favor and hit that like button as well as that subscribe button and ding that notification bell as well. Uh, we really do appreciate it. It helps these videos get out to the YouTube masses ASAP. And as always, this is not financial advice. I'm not a financial advisor. Crypto investing is risky. Let's get into it because we have a lot to cover. Just FYI, look at this chart. Isn't this one of the most beautiful charts you've ever seen? This is what elephant money is doing right now. Um, just to give you an idea of what we're getting involved with. And uh, it's only begun, and this parabolic movement, I don't think is over by a long shot. So let's let's get into it. So what is elephant money? Okay, basically, uh, well, first, elephant money was created by Tony Perkins. Uh, he goes by the name The Bank Teller. Now, first off, I like this project because it's not some anonymous people that you don't know who they are. It's by somebody who you could look up. He has a LinkedIn page. This is Tony Perkins. Okay, this guy is a legend in uh, decentralized finance. He actually put out one of the first uh, ROI compounding protocols called Bankroll Flow that was on the Tron network a couple years ago. I don't know how many of you guys remember that. And that was a pretty decent success, arguably. It did have some issues, uh, but it was the, his first experiment in that realm. And uh, ever since, uh, after bankroll flow occurred, um, the, there was a fork of bankroll flow that Forex Shark used to build the Drip Network. Okay, so this uh, gentleman's technology is prominent in DeFi. In terms of his background, he has been head of technology for companies like Fidelity um, and State Street Capital, okay, VP of Web Architecture, okay? This guy is the real deal when it comes to understanding computer, computer science, and finance. He has a degree in all of those. And his company, Mako Labs, is what's behind uh, the, the current project, Elephant Money. Again, Elephant Money, it's been around for about a few months now. Uh, it has been audited by Surtech and Solidity, and it's passed and it's done very well with its audits. Uh, so let's get a little bit further into it. What's the tokenomics of this project? So the tokenomics of the project, there are one quadrillion coins, tokens that have, that have been created. Now, we're going to talk about this in a minute, but um, this is a fixed supply uh, token, the elephant token. Uh, so they don't mint anymore. They don't burn them. There's a there's an interesting mechanism that works. We're going to get into that uh, in a minute, but there's only a fixed supply. And 49% of that supply was sent to what's called the graveyard, which is a unique burn address that they use for helping balancing liquidity and supply demand ratios. 1% was set aside for marketing. 25% was sent to investors who participated in the liquidity drive. And another 25% was sent to PancakeSwap for locked liquidity. The Elephant token is uh, their main token along with the Trunk token. So it's a two token system that they have here. And so the Elephant token is a fixed supply and it's a reflection token, kind of like Titano or something like that where you get your rebases, you get your earnings in your wallet. You don't have to stake it. You just have it in your wallet and it earns in your wallet. No need to worry about it. So the beauty about that is that you're getting paid two ways off of the elephant token. You're getting value two ways. You're getting A, you're getting the reflections. Every time uh, you get the reflections, your amount of tokens increases. They increase 
uh, based upon transactions from the elephant token. So basically your reflections are basically a percentage of the money that's invested into elephant. And so you get your, your percentage share of that. Okay, so that's how you get one way you get paid off of elephant token. The other way obviously is through appreciation. It has a very small market cap. So this token could actually really do a moonshot, honestly. It could be a 100 or 300 X token uh, based upon the small market cap and uh, the um, little amount of money that's in there right now. It could definitely do a 100 or 300 X. I could definitely see that in the future. Okay, so that's the elephant token. The other token is the trunk token. Now the trunk token is a stable coin. This is what's revolutionary that's different about what they're doing than anybody else. They have a stable coin. And the way that works is it's made up of 75% BUSD, which is a uh, is pegged to the dollar. It's the Binance stable coin. And it's the other 25% is an elephant. Okay. And so that's their other token is the trunk token. It's a stable coin, which is very nice. Now, the thing that they're doing that's game changing with the trunk token is they basically have a savings account where you can deposit your trunk token and earn interest on your trunk token, which is paying 66% APR or 192% APY, which is basically the APY is basically the APR compounded. Okay, so you're getting that um, on your base on the trunk token which again is like a stable coin and so just as a reference consider this anchor protocol that is uh the uh basically the savings account portion for ust which is a stable coin and that's like the gold standard right now for stable coins in terms of getting say uh interest on them and right now they're at 20 percent, 19 and change okay for their apy for their stable coin and that's considered the gold standard and this is a, at 66 percent so you're already doing better than anchor on a on a uh stable coin okay which is really great and now the other piece to this is when you deposit trunk now this is unlike something like drip where you make a deposit and that deposit goes away okay it, it's taken by the protocol of burned not with trunk token when you do the savings account when you do the savings account portion of trunk you deposit and it's not locked which means you can take your deposit out anytime you want you can withdraw anytime okay which is a big deal you can't do that with drip okay when with drip when you make a deposit it's gone and then you get that apr you get that one percent a day with this, you make the deposit with the savings account portion of Trunk, and you can take it out whenever you want. So your initial deposit is not locked. You still have it, which is a big deal. And there's a 1% fee when minting, okay? That's very small. It's not like a big 20 or 30% fee, okay? So that's the, that's the strategy right there um, with the Trunk token. Now, the se second piece of the Trunk token usage case is the Stampede Perpetual Bond. Basically, the way the Stampede Perpetual Bond works is that's more like drip, okay? Where you deposit it, you make your initial deposit, that initial deposit goes away and you get paid your APR, which in uh, this case is 205% over 365 days and or 768% APY over that same period. And so you get that, okay? And the beauty about this, you might say to yourself, well, why would I do uh, uh, the Stampede Bond with Trunk uh, and only get 205% APR? Why would I do that? And But instead of Drip, where I'm getting 365% APR? Well, that's a good question. The big difference is that, again, remember, Trunk is a stable coin. So it's not going to be fluctuating in terms of price with the market. If the market's going up or down, you have that consistent, reliable return as opposed to something like drip. Yes, you do get the um, the appreciation of drip as it does better. But as you see, it, when it does poorly, you're also subject to those losses. 
drip was at around 150 bucks and now it's down around 40 or 50 bucks right so you're subject to those swings you're not going to be as subject to that with something like trunk because it's a stable coin so it's a bit safer and again with this uh with the uh, Stampede Perpetual Bond, again, this gives you a higher APR than the regular trunk savings account, but your initial deposit is, t is locked and um, it, it's taken from you, okay? Like how drip works, okay? So the Stampede Perpetual Bond is locked, okay? It's locked, you, the, the initial deposit goes away and then you get that higher APR. Again, it's 205% APR, 768% APY with a locked deposit as opposed to, oops, as opposed to the regular trunk savings account, which is a 66% APR or a 192% APY, but it's not locked. You can take it out anytime you want which is really, really nice. So my main strategy is going to be involving the elephant token and the trunk token, the savings account portion. I think those are the best plays right here. I'm not really concerned too much about the Stampede Perpetual Bond. That high APR, I, I, I'm not a fan of the idea of my tokens being locked from me, okay, and taken away. I like to have more control. I like to have my initial deposit access to that. Again, that's that's my particular strategy. And, and remember, like I said, you might consider, oh, well, Stampede is only paying 205% APR as opposed to DRIP. Like I said, DRIP is 365. This is 205. DRIP is higher, but DRIP is not a stable coin. DRIP is subject to market fluctuations. This is less likely because remember, Trunk is 75% BUSD, which is a stable coin. Drip is not. Drip is going to be subject to all the market fluctuations and other activities. So it's a bit more of a safer play with dealing with uh, Drip. I'm um, sorry, dealing with Stampede. If you're a fan, if you're a fan of the higher APR, again, you're going to get that better, um, higher APR. You're going to get a stabler high APR with Drip. You're going to get a, a, a higher APR but less stable. With, I'm sorry, let me say that again. You're going to get a stabler, lower APR with the Stampede Perpetual Bond than with DRIP, where you're going to get a higher APR but less stable, okay, in terms of the value of the coin, okay, value of the token. Okay, guys, I just wanted to make that clear, all right? This is the website. So let's, you can, when you go on to elephant.money, you can either choose to participate in the elephant token that we just we spoke about, which has reflections, or you could uh, participate with the trunk slash stampede, okay, which is giving you the, again, a 66% up to 205% APR. And it's so right now, as of now, there's assets under management currently is $237 million. Okay, it's $191 million inside of the elephant and $15 million USD inside the trunk. The bet so the ideal strategy, especially for, for now, is to get in the elephant. You want to get as much of your capital into the elephant as possible because of the reflections and the appreciation that it sees based upon the ecosystem that they've created, okay? Um, and again, this is a fully doxed, fully audited protocol that's led by a gentleman, the banker, who has a, has a resume that is pretty much untouched in the DeFi space. Let's take a look at Elephant briefly. And uh, let's see here. So if you take a look at Elephant, you can buy it with BNB. This is all on the Binance Smart Chain, by the way. It's all on the Binance Smart Chain. You can easily buy it with BNB. I don't have any BNB in this particular wallet. Or you could take the contract address, bring that over to PancakeSwap, and you can purchase it using BNB or whatever currency you like. Okay, um, so that's something good to note. Now, when you look down here, it gives you the price 
the, the BUSD 1 million, uh, this is the price for 1 million elephant tokens. As you can see here, it's, it's very cheap. Look at the price. It's a fraction of a cent. It's 0 .00000 blah, 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 1723. Okay, so this thing is very inexpensive right now. All right, now the, it has $44 million liquidity. And the graveyard is that dead contract, that, that's the burn address. Now what happens is when coins are sent to the graveyard, as soon as this ratio hits 51%, there's the, that 1% is brought back into the market to help with the rebalancing. It's a very unique strategy that uh, no other platform like this has implemented, which, is, which helps create the proper supply-demand ratio economics to make this thing long-term. Um, and what you have here is the price dash SA. This is basically showing you the price, a, 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 a comparison, if you will, between the price of Bitcoin and the price of elephant. Now, if you ha believe that the, this elephant token can do well, which it, it can ex exceptionally do well based upon the tokenomics of it, if you bought the elephant token right now at its current price, it's the equivalent of what they're saying here. It's the equivalent of buying Bitcoin at $9. OK, based upon their calculation of where Bitcoin's price is now, based upon where Elephant's to to token is right now and the runway that it has uh, to perform. Um, this project, I believe, is going to do extremely well. I believe it's definitely a number one competitor for Drip. I believe both projects have legs. I like this one a lot more. I mean, just to be honest, the fact that the creator is a fully doxxed person who has a long history and track record in finance at the head of Fidelity, which we all know is a extremely bullish financial institution when it comes to crypto. Now, here we have the trunk. OK, the trunk is that stable coin piece. OK, that's the stable coin, 75 percent BUSD. 25% elephant. And so you can mint that here. And what you can do is you can roll over, just like in Drip, you can roll over your earnings back in to keep on getting that 66%. Okay, you can keep on compounding that again. When you compound uh, 66%, what, what was the number? Um, you're really getting 192% APY. Okay, if when you compound 192% APY, 66% APR, which is phenomenal on something that is 75% stable coin, that is miraculous. Okay, and then you, you would mint here, and then you would you would mint the trunk here, and then you would stake it right here. Pretty, pretty uh, self explanatory. Um, Okay, so you admit there and you would stay here, all right? Now, if you wanted to participate in the Stampede, which gives you the much higher APY, okay, you would be able to stake it here, okay? You would just, uh, you, would, you would bond, you would put the amount of trunk that you have and you would make that bond with, with this bond with the Stampede protocol. And then you'd be able to get this much higher APR. Instead of getting the 66% APR, you have the 205% APR. Okay. And uh, A, I would recommend what I'm going to do, not financial advice. I'm not a financial advisor by any stretch of the imagination. But my strategy is to get, uh, get not trunk, but to get the elephant, to buy elephant token First and foremost, as you see, that's where the majority of the money is going, is the elephant token because of the reflections, because of the way it, it's, uh, it's appreciating in value. This is the main thing here. And then supplementally get a little bit of the trunk 
or the Stampede to get those daily rewards like you would with Drip. This is basically paying out more of a stable form of Drip. Okay, guys, let me know what you think. I'll have my link for this because this is also, a, you need a buddy system. It's a buddy system. So you need a buddy for this. I'll have my buddy link in the description. Let me know what you think. What are your thoughts on this? I uh, just came out a few months ago. Um, you know, let us know what you think. This is going to be huge. Um, I'm confident of that. Uh, just by the people who are behind it and the 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 track record of what they've done. Again, keep in mind the creator of this created uh, bankroll flow and which is what actually create what is a fork of what drip is drip came from bankroll flow it's a lot of the same code you know no, uh, no knock to forex shark i love him to death uh but this he took a, a significant portion of the bankroll flow code to create his masterpiece drip network this is the guy that's behind that behind everything okay and this is the platform that they're launching now fully doxed audited the guy is public figure head of fidelity vp kind of stuff this is a serious project to look for to uh participate in in my opinion not financial advice just telling you what i'm doing okay guys let me know what you think leave me a comment below um hit that like button and the subscribe button and ding the notification bell as well if uh if you found value here all right talk to you soon Bye bye Hey guys, thanks so much again for viewing our wonderful video and please don't forget to hit the like button and the subscribe button if you found value in this and please ding the notification bell as well. Thanks so much, see you next time.